first thing is you make the to do list second is you prioritize if it's important urgent to you if it is important but not urgent to you if it is urgent but not important to you and if it is not urgent and not even important to you so you will prioritize things so you will get it more time for your important things in life similarly i have planned or made a, a time schedule sheet out of the material which i have got from different different workshops and uh, uh, material from different different videos i have been watching on youtube and different different books so i hope it helps you some people uh, who uh, have uh, like coming to my meditation classes and uh, been counseling from me have like uh, taken copies of this and made 30 and 40 copies of it that is making monthly journal for for them and they have got outstanding result out of it this is the time schedule sheet which i have made which you can work on daily basis i have used the activities of this book magic in this particular activity sheet too so say for example i have written over here thank you then thank you i am grateful for the wonderful surprise i am going to receive today so i am actually using law of attraction and power of gratitude to attract uh, something surprising happen to uh, me in this particular day of mine then Uh, the other thing is count your blessing and magic dust yourself that is count your blessings because it gives me a reminder but before starting my day i count my blessings and magic dust myself so that i use the power of gratitude over myself then uh, making the time sheet schedule so here we are mentioning time then here our to do list or i say magic touch your work that is making your list or the uh, task you want to do and uh, this column is the priority column which we have already discussed that is important urgent not important and not urgent things then it is here it is the uh, column of benefits or outcomes you have got from uh, doing this particular task or even you can uh, plan one day before and you can write i have a meeting with particular person at this particular time so what outcomes do i want so you can actually write what outcomes do you want out of this particular meeting so you become more goal oriented while you attend in that meeting so i have written thank you for manifesting outcome so if you want to make a effective time schedule chart then uh, in this particular column of time schedule you need to write the time half hourly and you need to write the whole 24 hours chart that is if you start your chart with 4:30 am so you'll uh, divide the rows into half hourly that is 4:30 to 5 then 5 to 5:30 and uh, so on and you end your chart by writing 4 to 4:30 you'll see in middle we sleep and we eat and things like that but once you draw this particular chart and say for example you wake up by 4:30 and you really get out of the bed by 7 so uh, from 4:30 to 7 you are going to write i am getting up so you understand when you fill this many rows by the thing i am getting up so you are actually understanding or making your brain trigger that how much time i am wasting similarly when say for example by 12 o'clock or by 1 o'clock you go to um, uh, take lunch and you come to work by 3 o'clock so from 1 to 3 you are actually feeling four of your line by just writing taking lunch taking lunch taking lunch so you understand when you fill this particular lines by the activities you are doing and when you prioritize things over here so you are you are actually giving pain to your brain so that it understand the value of time and he train your brain to not waste time and one uh, after doing this practice for so many days you will understand that this time schedule or wastage of time has been reduced automatically so automatically you are uh, becoming goal oriented and spending time so that you do important things in your life and you get what you want this sheet i have left the uh, space for three magical things that is the three uh, magical to do list what we are going to do in today's activity 18